As well as the tennis, Wimbledon is known for one thing, and that's its extremely long queue. And being Wimbledon, of course, they've produced this handy guide to queuing that everybody in the queue is given to tell them how to stand in a line. So we're going to ask people how good they are at obeying the rules and regulations of queuing. Have you seen one of these? I have, yes. Have you been given one of these? Do you think you've been obeying it? Uh, I'd hope so, yes. Let's see. What do you think of the, the English rules for queuing? They're very orderly, very safety first. We like that. Although no music, that's a bit mean. One of the guides obviously says uh, wear appropriate footwear and clothing. Yeah. Did you think about that? I did, yeah. We've, I got, got, some... we've got extra clothes in our backpacks. We've got waterproof umbrella and I've got shorts. We've got towels to sit on. We've got the, the visor, sunscreen, you know, you name it. Uh, hand sanitizer just in case. We've got everything. Can you talk me through your outfit today, your, your choice of clothing for Wimbledon? Uh, well, <laughs> well uh, it, it's in England, so I figured boots, um, uh, jeans, and it's, you know, might rain. You've got to dress for all occasions. Uh, who are you supporting today? A Fedra. <laughs> Uh, Andy, Andy. I've got some shoes with some cushioning because last time I wore flip flops so it was a bit uncomfortable. <laughs> it's just my jacket, uh, my leggings, my shoes, my glasses, and my bracelets. <laughs> One of the recommendations is to wear appropriate footwear. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Sun cream? Uh, no. No, you're just going to risk that. Let's not get carried away. One of the guidelines is uh, wear appropriate footwear and clothing. Yes. Can you talk me through your Wimbledon outfit? Uh, From the skin out. From the swell. <laughs> well, comfortable shoes. They were comfy shoes. Yeah, comfy shoes. Yeah. My dress that he signed for me on Monday. Marvellous. So. <laughs> you, you were in dinner Monday and, yeah. and he signed it then? Yeah. Yes. So this, what, you, what you're wearing now isn't your Federer? Outfit. No, these are my pyjamas. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. I just generally bought a cardigan, no coat and two dresses, so I'm just hoping that it's going to be sunny tomorrow. Have you brought provisions with you today? Have you got any... Uh... Um, I've brought an emergency pair. I've got an emergency pair in here, as you can see. <laughs> <laughs> Cheese and crackers, We've got some sandwiches. Strawberries, crisps, strawberries, <laughs> biscuits. <laughs> Chutney. And how have you been passing the time so far? Uh, inane conversation and uh, reading and rereading the uh, court times. There's a bit, there's a bit of fame. scrabble happening here, as you can see. I'm winning. Just, <laughs> just put that out there. Do you rush getting ready? What's... We plan to bring lots of stuff with yeah. us, but. Uh, we ended up just not being ready in time. We had to run to get the train, so we, we, we brought nothing. What have you not brought that you were planning to bring? A toy helicopter. One of the lines here is uh, excessive consumption of alcohol will not be tolerated. What do you think is excessive consumption of alcohol at Wimbledon? When you can't stand up. <laughs> have you seen any of that yet this morning? Yes. No, not this morning. A little yesterday? Yesterday. Yes. Yes. Excessive consumption of alcohol will not be tolerated. Mm. What's excessive? Uh, no. We've got one bottle between five of us. <laughs> What's excessive, would you say, for Wimbledon? Oh, gosh, excessive Less for Wimbledon. Less than cricket and football and rugby. <laughs> queue jumping is not acceptable and will not be tolerated. No, God, no. The last thing you want to see is queue jumpers. They should be thrown out. That's not it. very British. That's, a, that's it's in bold. It's obviously very important. Queue jumping is obviously a very British sin. <laughs> is, it, is it regarded as seriously in the U.S.? Well, you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to button line in the U.S. I mean, but I'm sure there are people who do save places. But, but I, I've never seen it so organised as this. It's extremely organised. This, yeah. this is quite a system. Can anybody top the British? Do you think? Ah, the British are about the lowest in the queue. The lowest. Oh. Why do you say that? Well, they're aggressive and they want to push. Is there anybody in the world? Do you think? Who, uh, who queues better than the English? Uh, I would hope not. It's uh, We haven't got much to hold on to, have we? So, uh, no, I'll take that. The English queue best. <laughs>